Hey guys, what's the topical? Nate here with Strange Wing, and today we're reacting to the official trailer for. I have a friend who spells his name that way, and he pronounces it Malik, but it might be Malik. I know a Malik too, and a Malik. First name Ramy. Me and him's like two peas in a pod, tight like Dale Braids. But you and I and him. It'll be tight like Dale Braids. Interacting through social media, which you can follow us on the links down below. The coffee one especially helps the channel because you can donate the monies to us. And we can have better quality videos, all that kind of stuff. Better sounding videos. So, you can do that. Or, if you ain't got the route the Nero, you can always subscribe. Like the video. That's yeah. free. It's true. We really need a bigger green screen. This frame's getting cramped. Yeah. ൂടെ <laughs> <laughs> ഒരു പ്രൊവോക്കേഷൻ ഇല്ലാതെ അധികം ഫോഴ്സ് അങ്ങോട്ട് അയക്കാൻ പറ്റത്തില്ല എന്തിനെങ്കിലും പേരിൽ ഒരു പരാതി അവിടെ ലഭിക്കും സാർ പിടിച്ച അമരന്റെ വെച്ചേക്കൂടി എന്റെ അനിയന് വേണ്ടിയിട്ടാണ് സുലൈമാൻ അത് ചെയ്തത് Malik, it looked all right. It looked like something that I could get behind, something that's easily investable in. Obviously, I don't know the whole story, and this is probably based on some real-life events, which, if this movie is good enough, I will do research afterwards. I'm a very busy person, so I don't want to do research beforehand, because one, it's going to ruin the movie. Secondly, I got to talk to all these honey dips. Thirdly, I got to edit videos. I got three jobs. You know how long I have to stand on a street corner to sell everything? A long time. I got a lot of stuff going on in Strange Wayne's life. I'm a very busy man. I'm up all night, up all day. I sleep four hours at a time. So I ain't going to waste time researching a movie if it's not good. So I'm going to watch it. And I hope it is good. Because it does look good based on the trailer. Uh, yeah, so this is definitely interesting to me. Uh, while I know very, very little about Indian culture and what I do know from Indian culture is mostly just come from how many trailer reactions we've done. Uh, what I do have a massive fascination with is like worldwide religions. Uh, and from what I understand, uh, there's a really interesting dynamic in India's like uh, religious culture in that uh You got a lot of people who feel really strongly about theirs, and then they have like a rapidly growing Islamic community as well. So you have like these two main religions, from what I understand, being Hinduism and the rapidly growing uh, Muslim population, with like Christians coming in at like really tiny little percent down at the bottom, right? Uh, so <clears throat> I am not... So being an american most of the religious based film religion based films that we get are uh terrible and like objectively like not because of subject matter like most of the religious based movies that are made here are like christian movies and they're all really bad they have terrible budgets they have terrible acting they have terrible scripts and in most of the time promote really unhealthy theology so i'm always just like Any movies that's like kind of based solely around a religious event, I'm usually kind of like, mm. because it's like 
you know, whoever's making that movie is just pushing their own agenda. So if this is more of a factual representation, like biopic style of something that this man actually did and not so much trying to push a specific religious agenda, then I'm here for it. If it's the opposite of that, then I'm not. Yeah, I'm just more interested of him working the op, but tell me what you think about that down in the comment section below. Scroll back up, hit the like button. Before you end, I, do, I, I thought about this in the trailer, I forgot to say it because I went on my tear. It's really funny to me how in all the uh, Indian trailers that we react to, every time there's a cop, he's always got like this big fucking pot belly. Yeah. <laughs> like that's just how like all the police are portrayed. <laughs> They're always just like these shirts that are like way too fucking tight in the shoulders and then just like this big pot belly. And it always makes me laugh because they all look the same. All the cops I know have pot bellies. <laughs> Tell me what you think about that down in the comment section. <laughs> Screw my up. Piece of shit. Like the video, share the video, and subscribe. It's not a game. It's a red stick.